On October 27, 1772, Patriot leaders James Otis and John Adams arrived along with Paul Revere at the shop of Benjamin Eads and John Gill, printers of the Boston Gazette. They were holding a clandestine meeting to formulate the Sons of Liberty response to royal salaries from Massachusetts provincial officials, a change that would make such officials responsible to the Crown only. Paul Revere was rising quickly in the ranks of the Sons of Liberty, but when Adams and Otis prepared to closet themselves for the discussion, Otis said, you, Mr. Eads, you, John Gill, and you, Paul Revere, can you stand there three minutes and shut the door? Revere might be a dependable courier and helpful to the Sons of Liberty as an organizer of his fellow mechanicals, but this assignment to guard duty was a reminder that as a mechanic, he was of a different social class than his Whig leaders. This Day in History brought to you by the Freedom Trail Foundation, partnered with the Massachusetts Teachers Association to bring history to life.